Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. So I am here today to do a Dollar Tree planning essentials video. So these are very basic things that you can pick up at the Dollar Tree for extremely cheap, obviously a dollar to get started with planning. So let's go ahead and get into the video. So the very first thing you're going to need, of course, is a planner. The Dollar Tree, especially during this time of the year, has a variety of planners. You can also find them when they put out their back to school items. Usually, um, the middle of July is when they usually put them out and they have a variety of planners. So the first planner I'm going to show you, it says that it is a monthly 2020 planner. And then when you go into it, you get your little personal information page. You get all the basics that you look at in any planner. So you get your years at a glance. It gives you holidays and important dates for two years. Then you get all these little toll-free numbers, conversion tables, all kinds of stuff. And then you get into your actual planner. So right here you have like a horizontal layout for you to write things in. It starts on December the 30th of 2019. It goes through 2020. And that's pretty much what this planner looks like. It's very basic. You can go through and doodle in these and washi tape, all kinds of stuff. So you have this particular layout right here. So this is a completely horizontal layout. Now you get into something like this and this is a monthly page format. It is a Jot 2020 planner, but it has cute little butterflies all over it. So a lot of us are inside that cutesy stuff and why not pick out something that's gonna be cute and pretty and something that you can probably bedazzle and put your name down there and like some felt letters, whatever the case may be. So you get a personal information page on this planner. Again, you know, you get a, um, you actually get a personal directory right here. So that's nice. You can put in important phone numbers and addresses. You get your 2020 holidays and dates. And then here is the actual format of the planner. So right here you have your full month laid out for you, but you get a couple of lines to write things down. This would be perfect for your budgeting to write down your bills. Um, you know, if you're not into the elaborate washi tape and stickers and all that planner stuff that a lot of us are into, if you're just a functional person, this is perfect for you and it's only a dollar. So you get a note section on the sidebar, numbers, and a note section and reminder section at the bottom. So you get that for every month. And then in the back, let's see what we have going back here. You got a lot going on back here. I didn't know about all this stuff. So you have a 2020 planning guide. So that's interesting. Maybe for you to look ahead and see, you know, the particular dates of the month. If you want to go ahead and mark stuff out, um, ladies, this will probably even be great for period tracking or tracking your ovulation, whatever the case may be. If you're planning to have a child, you also have more uh, phone book pages back here, quite a bit of those. And then you also get, let's see, conversion tables, postal abbreviations, so the different states. U.S. military, U.S. Commonwealth and Territories, and then you get a couple of sheets of notebook paper. You also get these cute little folded things you can stick in there. So that's the basic. That's the number one thing that you need are your planners or a planner. Whichever you're using, if you're using one or multiple, you got to start with a planner. So the next thing are your pens. The Dollar Tree has a variety of just basic pens. You can get them in black, blue, variety ink, whatever the case may be. So right here, I just have some of these ink roller pens and they're a 0 0.7 millimeter tip and they are roller ball pens in black ink. They also have these in blue. These are actually great pens. And then you have your gel pens right here. It says premium quick dry ink. So you get green, blue, purple, and pink in case you wanted a variety in your planner. So you definitely need this and they have those available. The next thing you may look into getting at the Dollar Tree are your very basic essentials, which are sticky notes. These are great for color coordinating. If you don't want to directly write something down in your planner, you can put it on a sticky note and just stick it in there, especially if it's something that is subject to change, like an appointment or a meeting, things like that. So they have these jot sticker note flags. You get 400 sheets of them and they're in a variety of colors, which are great for color coding. And you also get these jot sticky notes. You get 300 sheets of those and you get four different color options. Obviously, it's a bigger size if you need to write down more information. So these things are always available at the Dollar Tree. The next thing you may want to add is any kind of tape or decor to your little planner. 
So you have here some washi tape. They have these at the Dollar Tree. Uh, sometimes they're hard to come across and others usually always find them. Uh, they have different patterns on them. This is just the one that I picked up for this particular video. It's got cute little uh, page flags on them. So this washi tape, it's like decorative tape. You can stick it in your planner to remind you of something or if you just want to uh, decorate your page. And they also have available the Scotch brand double-sided tape. They also have this in the Jot brand. You can use this to stick different things into your planner. Maybe some embellishments or if um, a movie ticket you might want to save or some pictures, you can use this to adhere it to your planner page. So these are available always at the Dollar Tree. It may not be these specific brands, but they always have some form of these types of tapes. And last but not least, I call these specialty items because they're not necessarily needed, but if you really get into planning, you may want to pick these up. So these are the Jot paper clips to get 80 of them in there. Uh, these are in a variety of colors, but they also have them in silver. And these are great if you want to save your place in your planner, or even if you want to make your own customizable paper clips. I have videos of those. I'll put them down below in my description box. So they have these available. You get quite a bit of them for a dollar. And they're a good size as well. They're not the mini ones. These are kind of the, the larger ones they have there. And then these. This right here is one of those hidden planner gems that you pick up at the Dollar Tree. This is a four pack of the Tool Bench Hardware Tweezers. Now I specifically picked this out because this set of tweezers right here is very similar to the tweezers that I always use in my planning videos. If I can get a hold of them. These right here, I picked these up from Hobby Lobby. Um, they are like quilting type of tweezers. Uh, people pick them up from different brands, but this is just the one that I have. And these are great for picking up tiny stickers. Now this particular tweezer of mine is similar to this one right here, the second one. But you can use any of these really for your stickers in your planner. So that's why I have included it in this video because it's a hidden planner gem at the Dollar Tree. All right, y'all, so that is the end of the video. And I just wanted to let you all know that this is actually a hidden giveaway video. So I'm giving away this entire package of Dollar Tree planning essentials to someone in my comment section. So with this being a hidden giveaway, I do just wanna let you know some of the rules. You do have to be 18 years or older. I am only shipping in the United States because of shipping cost. And you must put down in my comment section that you love to plan. So if you put that down there, I will include you in the drawing for the giveaway. The giveaway will end on October the 20th. So on the 20th, I will pick a winner. And I just want to thank you all so much for your love and support. Again, don't forget to write in my comment section that you love to plan. Do, my, do not mention anything about a giveaway because I will delete the comment. So again, thank you all so much for watching this video. And I'll talk to you again in my next one. Bye.